Yo, what is going on, everyone? Welcome back to the Zen Lounge. I have some exciting news to share with you. The UAE has some big updates for us, especially I'm going to show you a clue that Sologenic team is left behind. UAE announces a crypto free zone. UAE set to open the world's first free zone dedicated to digital and virtual asset companies. Let's read the main point that I want to show you guys. I'm going to make this really big so you can read along with me. The UAE Crypto Free Zone, RAK Digital Assets Oasis, will open for applications in the second quarter of 2023, becoming the only free zone in the world exclusively for digital and virtual asset companies that are innovating new, in new and emerging sectors such as metaverse, blockchain, utility tokens, virtual asset wallets, NFTs, DAOs, decentralized applications, and other Web3 related businesses. So this is huge utility tokens. If we're thinking about utility token, the solo solo token is by definition a solo token. There's many use cases to it. And look in the roadmap. Look at the roadmap for quarter two, guys. Quarter two, they are mentioning specifically the UAE. So if we scroll down here, quarter two to quarter three, they're going to launch the securities tokenization platform pilot program. And they're also submitting a new application for a broker dealer license in the UAE. So they're gonna have a broader market launch of Sologenix tokenization platform in compliance with regulations. We just seen the UAE announce basically the crypto free zone. So the UAE is going to be tokenized and they're welcoming businesses to come innovate. And Sologenix is ready to pounce on that opportunity, it looks like. You guys seen, I just shared, uh, Uphold is officially uh, going to be part of the Snapshot airdrop, and they're also going to be listing Corium. So March 23rd, you'll be able to purchase Corium on Uphold. So two major events, Corium listing March 23rd, and March 24th, the Snapshot for Corium airdrop. Remember, there's 100 million Corium, um, and there's 50 million X4. So the 100 million quorum is going to quorum holders and the 50 million X core, 25 million to XRP holders, 25 million to solo holders. I got many videos, many videos teaching you guys how to get set up, set up with that. Make sure you guys get that set up. It's going to come by quick and you'll be kicking yourself if you don't set up this airdrop. Even if you don't even like the project, just do it. It's like getting a free sample at Costco. You're able to try it out, get some for free. If you don't like it, the worst thing that could happen is you could sell it for more XRP or whatever currency you like. But this is an invitation to join the Quorium community. Uh, Quorium is sitting at 57 cents. A lot of people are expecting a much more, uh, a bigger pump. And uh, yeah, we're sitting at 57 cents before the snapshot. We're sitting at 17 cents for Sologenic token. And we're sitting at 38 cents for XRP at the moment, the trifecta. So another big thing was a lot of people are talking about the ISO 20022 announcement and Quorium smart token technology enables uh, seamless ISO 20022 compliance by leveraging automated automation, data consistency, and interoperability in financial messaging, a breakthrough for efficient global transactions without compromise. So Quorum is positioned for this new ISO 20022 error. And uh, I believe as time goes further, we'll see more connections with uh, what they're doing with the ISO messaging. Also, Bob Ross wanted to let us know about the Telios project. Telios is an innovative project in development on Quorum blockchain, which leveraging the power of smart token technology. This is a decentralized email and cloud storage solution shaping the future for web three. The future is decentralized. I just had a whole video about how the future is going to become more and more decentralized. More and more people are going to want decentralized options. And now we have options for cloud storage and email where we could basically do that decentralized. Um, so Telios, you can follow them on uh, Twitter. They're a privacy first email service that protects your data. Uh, it'd be great to get them to come on and have a conversation with the Zen Lounge, right? We'll see if I could do that for you guys. Uh, other than that, I want to leave you with some uh, funny things. You guys have all seen the trend with Jim Cramer, right? Jim Cramer, they call him inverse Cramer, Cramer now. Well, matter of fact, let's talk about this. Let's talk about something a little bit wild real quick. So Archelect, if you Google Archelect, it's actually known artificial intelligence. And I was tripped out because this AI posted, I thought this looked just like the Corium logo, but that's just a conversation for another day. What I really want to show you is, Jim Cramer about a week ago said, 
JP Morgan is a fortress and everything he does like the opposite. JP Morgan said to sell all your Bitcoin and it pumped to the moon like 20%. And uh, he said JP Morgan is a uh, fortress. And then you see all this news coming out that JP Morgan Chase can be sued for their relationship with Epstein. So that's something to keep your eye on. Let's keep an eye on this rabbit hole. But that's all I got for you guys today. Um, by the way, Zen Lounge is fully prepared. Our nodes are synced, ready for mainnet, for Corian mainnet. I believe this validator is state-of-the-art and ultra secure and safe for you guys. I put my blood, sweat, and tears into this project. Most of you guys have seen me working on this for a year. And this project is finally almost done. I'm so excited. Thank you for everyone that's basically telling me they're going to support the project. Uh, I'm going to make... We're going to make the cosmos great again with Zen Lounge Validator. We're going to make staking fun again. I have a bunch of exciting things planned for the stakers, and we're going to make, you know, cosmos fun, staking fun. So uh, we are not on testnet anymore. So if you go to the Block Explorer and you don't see Zen Lounge Validator on testnet, do not be alarmed. That's on purpose because we're getting prepared for the launch that's happening in a few days. So remember, I'm going to be having an educational tutorial for you guys teaching you how to stake to Zen Lounge Validator in the next few days once I have all the stuff to make the video for you guys, which should be coming soon. So we're, you're going to have to basically uh, bridge your tokens from the XRP ledger to, you're going to bridge them from the XRP ledger to uh, Corium mainnet, and then you'll be able to stake them. So the first thing if you want to get prepared is download a Cosmos Station wallet or a LeapFrog wallet, Leap Wallet, either one, Cosmos Station or Leap Wallet. Get your private key set up. And get ready to use the bridge. The bridge will be located here. I'll give you a sneak peek. You're going to access the decks on sologenic.org and you'll notice in the top corner. Okay. You'll notice in the top corner, in the top of sologenic.org, there is a bridge. And this is where the magic is going to happen in a few days, guys. So be on the lookout for my educational video. And uh, I'm so excited for the future, guys. Quarter two looks like it's going to be Sologenic's time to shine. Quarter one was all about launching Corian's main net. My hypothesis is they're ready to unleash Solo out of its cage. And it's going to pounce on the tokenization of the UAE. UAE opened the doors for us and the team is ready to execute. We have Auto Nino, we have everything that we need to uh, tokenize and Solo Nation could potentially really have the opportunity to show what they've been building the past three years. You know, so all eyes on Q2 for Sologenic and let's keep an eye out for uh, Quarium. Let's see if it's gonna pump before the snapshot or, or if this is it. Everybody have an awesome day. Remember, this video is not financial advice. We're sharing research information. Um, check out the uh, links in the description below. Peace.